An important warning from the Warwick School Superintendent for parents and students tonight. School could be canceled tomorrow. There are rumors of a potential sick out by teachers as a more than year long contract dispute continues. But the teachers union says it's just that, a rumor. Eyewitness News reporter Kelly Sullivan has more on what the teachers union president had to say from Warwick now. The Warwick superintendent sent out an email to parents saying that there might be a sick out on Thursday and parents need to plan accordingly if school is canceled. However, the teachers union president said that that's all a rumor that the superintendent started. The issue still remains that teachers are working on expired contracts. Wednesday afternoon, Warwick School Superintendent Philip Thornton sent out an email to parents saying it received credible reports that the teachers union was pressuring its members to call in sick Thursday. All of that is a lie. There, there is no sick out. I never pressured anyone. The email said his office was trying to confirm those reports. No one ever called the union office. The superintendent has my cell phone number and I have his and he never called me. Over the phone, Superintendent Thornton tells Eyewitness News teachers report absences through a computer system. I can tell you in the last, um, say, half hour since our message went out, we had several teachers um, unselect their sickness. Superintendent Thornton's email claims that this is an attempt to protest teacher contract negotiations that have stalled. We are moving forward. Uh, unfortunately, it's uh, not as fast as we'd like to move. The teachers' union contract expired in August of 2015. Union President Darlene Netko says teachers will continue to work and hope negotiations can eventually be reached. But in the meantime, she says the students are the ones who are suffering. When you load 28 kids in a class and 15 of them have um, individual education plans and they need individual attention and assistance and you don't put a special ed teacher in the class because you're not following our contract, then that's detrimental to education. The teachers union president says that the sick out will not happen. The superintendent says if teachers call out sick, they need to do so an hour before school starts. So he'll be up early Thursday morning monitoring the numbers, determining if school needs to be canceled. Of course, we'll stay on top of the story and have an update for you on Eyewitness News this morning starting at 430. Reporting in Warwick with the West Bay Mobile Newsroom, Kelly Sullivan, Eyewitness News.